multinational and multi-confessional society located at the cross of thousands of geopolitical and religious issues, Kazakhstan has chosen its own path of multicultural peace. The visit of Pope John Paul II to Astana and the policy aimed at international cooperation have shown the identity of Kazakhstan to the world as the country of multicultural consent. The creation of such a state model became possible thanks to formula of peace and consent of the first president of the Republic of Kazakhstan, Nursultan Nazarbayev. It includes nuclear disarmament, creation of CICA, Eurasian integration, Congress of the leaders of world and traditional religions, Turkic Council, OSCE chairmanship, Initiation of Organization of Islamic Cooperation, Manifesto of the 21st Century, a non-permanent membership of Kazakhstan in the UN Security Council. At the beginning of the 21st century, at the time of internally clashing religions and terrorist attacks, Nur Sultan Nazarbayev, the first president of the Republic of Kazakhstan, initiated a practical solution. Over the years, Kazakhstan has welcomed six congresses with the 366 delegations. Since 2003, the number of countries and participants have increased exponentially. The first ever congress welcomed the leaders of world and traditional religions from 13 countries of Europe, Asia and Africa. Successful completion of the first congress urged Kazakhstan to build a home for all confessions in the world especially for the Congress of Leaders of World and Traditional Religions, Kazakhstan built the Palace of Peace and Reconciliation in 2006. Over the past 16 years, the Congress has established its institutional structure, which includes Working Group and the Secretariat, as well as the Council of Religious Leaders, identifying the agenda of the Congress. The Museum of Peace and Reconciliation was opened to keep the historical memory of the Congress, and a Stan International Prize for contributing to interfaith dialogue was established in Kazakhstan. As part of the declaration of the 6th Congress, the religious leaders proposed to establish the Center for Development of Interfaith and Intercivilization Dialogue as a recognition of outstanding contribution of the first president of the Republic of Kazakhstan to global efforts to foster peace and harmony.